Hello everyone, it's the Dats Mafia Coffee with another video and I just had my first day of school. Just literally just now I just put my bag away now and stuff and it was good, it was good. I at first when I came in everyone knew that I wasn't actually I wasn't actually like born in Ghana because obviously because of my hair and because I had I haven't had I don't have the uniform yet and then um so they're asking me oh what what um do you um do in the UK what part of the UK are you from so I obviously said London and I was like do you like football what team do you support that's what all the boys were asking me and then after that at the lessons I had for that throughout that entire day was science Twi, which was hard, um, French, English, and then last but not least, social studies. And then, so first for science, we're talking about um, the cells, animal cell and plant cell. And then after that, we had to, um, we were talking about genes and chromosomes and stuff. And then because this group, the age range is like 12, 13, 14, so they're still trying to complete their GCSEs. Or as they call it there, they, as they call it here, they call it O-Levels. And I've already completed it, so it's like repeating for me. So I'm just getting a refresh of what I've done already. So I kind of knew a bit. And then after science, after we learned all that, we learned three. And we were doing the Akan stories. And it was, I had to write all in three. I was so confused. I just had to copy what was on the board. And I was so confused because the... Uh, because the auntie she'll speak to them to you throughout the whole the whole lesson pretty much literally nine percent of two and then so i was confused what she was saying i got some bits but most of it i didn't get that much after three i did what was the lesson um i had ing no french french i had french and then during french i did um the French is different in Ghana than it is in the UK. Like one word in the UK will mean something. I mean in Ghana it's like a whole different French word for that same word. So I had to get used to it and stuff. And that was it was all challenging and stuff. And um yeah, so for example, if you're talking about in the past tense or whatever, so you're talking about past, present and future. I mean, it's all different words to the past, present and future in the UK, like different rules and stuff so that's something i'm gonna have to get used to and then after french was a uh, break no after english was after um, not english after tweet was break and then at break i thought break was lunch so i had the big fried fried rice with stew and salad and sausage for lunch and that only cost six cities because yeah there's that you have to buy it from the shop there in the school and then i got a coke which cost two cds the one that you have to return the bottle so i enjoyed that pretty pretty much i rated that lunch overall an eight out of ten and then um after after that well not lunch it was break but after that break we went that's when we did french and i just spoke about french now and then after french was english and then for english you're talking about adjectives and um good and bad adjectives and um, superlative adjectives and comparing adjectives and stuff so we're just talking about that using it in the sentence you know simple simple english stuff for me and then after that we had lunch at lunch i wasn't hungry obviously so i just got a bottle of sprite which is a two cities again and then um yeah i was just walking around with the friends i met and stuff we were just talking and then after that, that was when social studies start. So at the start of social studies, the teacher also came in and he, he called, he said, all the boys get out of the classroom. And then we had to get out and then we had to follow him to like, the stairs. And under the stairs, there was a bunch of broken table legs, like t broken tables and chairs and things like that. And then what we have to do, we have to carry it from, get it up on the under the stairs and carry it all the way to another room in the, in my block, in our block, because our block's different.
to the other younger people's block. So we have to carry it to a room near there. And then remember it was hot as well, so we were carrying it going back and forth, back and forth. And the tins and the tins and chairs were dusty, man. And it was just dusty, my hands were getting dirty and stuff. So we were carrying that. And then at the end, when there was only like one table left, there was, um, we, it was three of us on our way to put something away. And the two boys that we also knew were walking back to go to get something else to put away. And then we told them, ah, uh, so we said, oh guys, sir, sir said that you should go get the, you should go get the table. Both of you, I'm about to give you two, two strokes of the cane. And then they actually, they didn't believe us. And then they actually listened. They were like, okay. And then on our way back, we saw them coming over the table. So they didn't know that we completely lied to them. We just, we just joked about it to them. And then, and then, yeah, we said that. And then during social studies, we were talking about um, tourism and tourist attractions in Ghana and like the prices of it and why people go there and stuff. I mean, that was mainly for social studies. I mean, after social studies was, um, it was home time. And that was it, that was the end of school. So that was my experience with school overall. So out, out of 10 overall, it's probably an eight out of 10 to a nine out of 10. So I'll give it like an 8.5 out of 10 because everything was, was um, it was good. I liked the children there. I liked the food. I liked the way that we learn and stuff. The only reason I wouldn't give it a ten out of ten is because like in the class it's a bit hot sometimes, and I didn't bring enough water. I only bought one bottle, which I finished like so quickly. So I had to um, I just had to like just make do for the rest of the day. But then other than that, it was good. It was all good. Okay guys, thank you for watching the video. Overall I liked I liked the school. I gave it a 8.5 out of 10. So make sure oh yeah, I forgot to say one more thing. Now that I actually have to attend school and stuff now, I might not be posting videos every day or I might I'll not be posting it every day, maybe like twice a week or once a week now. Cause as you know I've been posting videos every day just to try and get my views and stuff up. So yeah, just to give you guys a heads up, that's what will be happening. So make sure to like, make sure to subscribe, turn on notification bells, and make sure to share this video to everybody you know. And this is where that's an African coffee with more videos to come. Peace.